Is this you? Have you ever waited for a package? And once you receive your package, you're joyful and ecstatic? I got my package, I got my package. You're excited to open the package. Woo, I'm opening up my package. But you see this. Oh no. What is this? This isn't even the texture I, oh my gosh. Or this happens. Reality is setting in that you will never see your package. Hey, Mr. Mailman, before you leave. So I had a package coming. I ordered it like 30 days ago. Have you seen it? Is it in your vehicle? It's not. Um, you don't have anything from my apartment? You haven't had any pack? Thank you, you can, I know you got a busy shift. Yeah, yeah. I'll see you next time. All right. You've just been scammed by an online company. Three things you should do once you've been scanned by an online company. Hello, I am Cindy and Nicole. Please like, comment, share, subscribe to this channel. And today I'm going to be telling you three things that you should do once you've been scammed. That's right. It might not have happened to everyone, but it's happened to me. And these are the three things I did. Number one, gather all evidence receipts okay pictures screenshots whatever evidence you have you that's what you need to come with right so like i said all the emails that you've been back and forth with the company if that's happened to you and make sure you have pictures of the items that you purchased make sure you take screenshots of the actual website that you bought it from because they might be sneaky and delete it later on. <laughs> Make sure you do that. Because this is going to lead us to our next fact, which is number two. File a dispute with your bank. That's right. You can get your money back. It may not be from the company, but you can. So don't feel like, oh my gosh, I'm just out of money. Go to your bank and file a beautiful dispute because all that evidence that we just spoke about in numero uno, you're going to give that right on to the bank. And don't worry, you may have a company try to combat the bank saying, no, it's not a scam. But guess what? You kept your receipts and you are going to win the battle because that's what happened to me. I had a company try and say, they weren't scamming to the bank. And I was like, no, I have receipts. I can talk about that in another video. Anywho, three, what you need to do now is go on all of their social media and blast them and warn people. Make sure you do this before they block you on their social media because they will if they haven't already. What? Go on your social media, blast them and warn people. Do you have to do it? No, but you should do it. Come on now. It'll make you feel better and it'll let the next person to know that they're not loyal and they're lying to you. So please like, comment, share, subscribe to this channel. 
and next week i might talk about how not to get scammed let me know if you want to see that one once again thank you for watching this i'll see you next time bye